Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. Welcome to Wednesday, the 28th day of September, 2022. Our topic today on the Seeds of Destiny is Testimonies and Evidence Outreach, a method of soul winning. We've been talking about soul winning, its importance and all that. Now today I want to see what, it, what avenues we can use. The Bible says, Oh, give thanks unto the Lord, call upon his name, make known his deeds among the people. Sing unto him, sing psalms unto him, talk ye of all his wondrous works. Psalm 105, verse 1 to 2. Thought for the day. Making known to the world what God has done is a very vital method of evangelism. Our anchor scripture reveals that testimonies and evidence outreach is a method of soul winning. Making known to the world what God has done is a method of winning souls or evangelism. That was what the leper did when he was healed. Mark chapter 1 verse 45. It says, But he went out and began to publish it much and to blaze abroad the matter, insomuch that Jesus could not enter openly into the city, but was without in desert places, and they came to him from every quarter. One man's testimony brought people from every corner. Testimonies and evidence outreach is a key to the salvation of the lost. The woman of Samaria is another very, very good example. Now, in John chapter 4, verse 28 to 30, it says, The woman then left her water pot and went her way into the city and said to the men, Come! See a man who told me all things that ever I did. Is not this the Christ? And then in verse 30 says, Then they went out of the city and came unto him. They trooped to him. They left the whole city and trooped to him. When she gave the testimony of how Jesus saved her, the whole city went out and followed her because of her testimony. The testimony could be your own testimony or another person's testimony. Maybe something you heard in church. You could share it with a friend, share it with a neighbor, share it with people on the street. For example, you can tell somebody, beloved, something happened in church this week. I was in church and a woman was brought to church in a wheelchair and after the message the pastor prayed for her and commanded her to walk to the amazement of everybody she got up out of the wheelchair and she began to walk all right these are testimonies you can share you will never lack it from any of the services in dynamis so you see not everybody may be able to preach but everybody can tell a story just tell the story say what you saw in church just give a testimony and you will win souls for christ remember this making known to the world what god has done is a method of soul winning or evangelism what's our assignment today the first one is don't hesitate to share the wondrous works of god to your friends or your loved ones and then secondly understand the message from every testimony that is preached and apply it apply it praise the lord let's pray say after me oh lord i receive the grace to publicize your good works to my generation in jesus name amen praise the lord i'm excited and i believe that god has heard and answered your prayers i'd like to pray for you today you want to be born again you want jesus to be the lord of your life simply pray this after me say lord jesus thank you for dying for my sins i know i'm a sinner i need your help jesus please come into my life be the lord of my life wash away all my sins make me a new person from today i turn my back on sin i will live to please you o lord in jesus name amen praise god congratulations and i pray for you it's your birthday today i wish you a very happy birthday as your days are so shall your strength be god cause his face to shine on you and be gracious unto you in jesus name amen god bless you have a wonderful day